So you've just installed OBS Studio and you're excited to use OBS Studio for your own recordings and videos, but you have this problem right here. It's just a black screen. How am I supposed to record anything? Where's my recording? Where's my videos? How do I fix this? Well, this video will answer all of those questions and more. So the first thing you want to do is go to sources here and press this plus icon here. There's going to be a lot of these choices here, but when you choose one, your problems are pretty much fixed. But I will go through three common ones that you will be using when recording. Let's get started. So the first common one that we will be using is game capture. So let's go to sources, go at the bottom, add source, and then press game capture. As the name implies, game capture will capture the game that you tell OBS Studio to. So press OK here, add mode, capture any full screen application, change that to capture specific window. Now here on window, change this to the game that you want to specifically record. So for example, I have this Roblox game running right now and I want to record this gameplay. That's an easy fix. All you have to do is go to window and find Roblox here. I'm going to press OK and in a few seconds, Roblox should pop up on the screen now. So there we go. It popped up on my screen and this is basically it. Whatever I do in this game, OBS Studio will record it and it will be captured. Moving on to the next source, window capture. Now what this basically will do is capture anything from the specific window that you tell OBS Studio to record. So for example here, I have this chess game running in my Google Chrome and I want to record this. That's an easy fix. All you have to do is go to sources again, add source, window capture and press OK. Here at window, all you have to do is choose the specific window that you want to record. In this case, I only have the Google Chrome window open. I want to capture that and then press OK. Now that's pretty much it. Whatever you do on this window, OBS Studio will capture everything on this window and only this window. Now moving on to the last source is display capture. Same thing, go to sources, add source, and then press display capture. Now as that name implies, what this basically will do is whatever is displayed on your monitor or whatever you see, OBS Studio will also capture. So let's press OK. You don't have to do anything over here. The default settings should be fine press OK. And that's basically it. Everything I do on my monitor, OBS Studio will also capture. So if I open this, OBS Studio will also capture that. If I open Roblox, OBS Studio will also capture that. So those are all the three common sources that you will be using in OBS Studio. Now keep in mind, if you use either window capture or game capture, OBS Studio will only capture the things that are going on in that specific game or that specific window that you tell OBS Studio to record. Now on the other hand, display capture does capture everything on your monitor. So everything you see, OBS Studio will also capture, but the downside is it would be very laggy. So in the case of gaming while using display capture, it would be extremely laggy for both you and OBS Studio. So I recommend to not use display capture for any gaming purposes or anything unless it is needed. So that would be all for this video. Hopefully I helped your black screen problem in setting up OBS Studio. If I did help, please subscribe, like, and don't forget to comment. If you're still having any problems, I would like to hear from you either in the comments or you can contact me on Discord in the description. Thank you all for watching and I'll see you in the next video.